His vacation takes a sludgy turn. Uh, hi, yo, it's me, I'm Mario Adorable, here again with Mario Sunshine, Super Mario Sunshine, in fact. This ain't no ordinary Mario Sunshine. And last time, I believe we cleared out more or less all we could from Rico Harbor at the moment. Uh, let me verify that, actually, because now I feel like maybe that's not true. Nah, that's true, because then the last one is Yoshi time. Okay, cool. So in that case, where to next? I suppose the beach, right? Because the, where the lighthouse is missing. That seems to be the next logical course of action. I mean, the lighthouse is a freaking important. That's like the tallest thing in this place, except for... I guess maybe the Shine Gate and like half the apartment buildings. So it's like halfway up the list of the tallest things in this place. Alright, this time, I know I was memeing before, but this time I'm actually gonna beat this thing with my eyes closed. Once I spawn it in. Make no mistake, I can do it. Okay. Okay. Okay, I see. Oh, I got it. Did you hear that? I got I just did it got it with, with, with Oh, I'm getting it. I'm getting it by just messing around. Oh wait, I I I heard it. I hit it with closed mouth. Ah! I got it. Okay, crap. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll open my eyes just for to get to reopen phase 2, but I'll do the actual fighting bit of it with oh, closed eyes. All I have to do is spin around, because then I'll hit it. I'll hit, hit it eventually. Ah, damn it! Ah, I need to get out of the goop. But then I'll close my eyes for real. Okay. Ah, oh, come on! I was hitting it so well before. How did I screw this up? I was hitting it so well and coming by accident. No! Wait. Did you see I got it three times with my eyes closed? Ah, well, that, I'll count that as close enough. I did beat one phase of it. The small ones are one phase only anyway, so it's basically the same thing. Oh, I guess I was missing it because it went back under, is that right? Oh, hey, there's a thing just floating up there. That's cool. Oh, this thing is gone. I didn't, I'm surprised I actually managed to hit it at all with my eyes closed just by doing that. But I guess it makes sense. But I mean the timing wise. Those bosses are so silly. Why do they even... <laughs> I don't know. It's just, it just seems silly to me. Oh, sorry there, buddy. I probably should have been rescuing you instead of goofing around challenging myself to beat things with my eyes closed, shouldn't I? Thanks, Mario! No problem. A long time ago, Yoshi's lived on this island as well! Well, that sucks to be them, I guess. Because I take it they died. Gelato Beach! Dune Bud Sand Castle Secret. Oh boy, starting with the secret mission? Have we done that? Already? Or, that's cool. I think this is the first time where a secret mission has been our first, uh, mission. Howdy! Oh man, this place is beautiful. I always forget that. Hey you! Don't get the water dirty here. And don't step on the doom buds. Thanks for your cooperation! No problem. Mario is nothing if not a cooperative bugger. Pardon you, you rude bastard. <laughs> I can't believe you just stood in the way of my water as I jet streamed it at you. Well, we've already found a blue coin, so that's good news. Although I guess I don't know where exactly where it goes. Uh, is that- is that all the way on the other side of the beach? Oh, I guess not. Oh, yes it is! I lied. Well, ain't that dandy. 58! Oh my goodness! I didn't realize how many of them I'd been gathering. Well, that's just dope! That's two freebies right off the bat! And I also noticed- ah, my stupid earbud. Um, that the- the- one of these cataquacks is red, while the other ones are blue, and I think maybe that indicates something? Hopefully it means a blue coin coming my way if I hit it, because I believe the other ones do yellow coins. I I'm not trying to be coy about this, I literally just don't remember. <laughs> I, I have played this game before, I, I, I should. I probably, it feels, feels right to remind at this point that I have, I have played this game. Oh, and actually the, the Cataquack can probably launch us up to those uh, coin lines, that's probably how we're supposed to do that. Does one of them have a blue coin at the end of it? That would be cool. Oh, the gulls are flocking over there, and my first thought, because I just stopped playing Wind Waker, was oh man, there's a big octo around. All right, stop chasing me. That's just uncultured. Look, I know I'm very ah. I'm a very exciting person with my red cap and my jet power hose, but it does not give you the right to just go and and you know punt me through 30 feet into the air with your face. I think. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's not a thing that's socially accepted. Otherwise, I've been going to I've been doing parties wrong my whole life. Although I suppose I haven't been doing parties right my whole life either. Uh, so the Dune Bud Castle secret, you say, is that? Uh, I don't- I know- I'm pretty sure a sand castle is the kind of castle is meant, but how does one- does one make up the sand castle with- ah <laughs> Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to land on you. Uh, are you okay? Have you ever heard of the sand portal? It's a sand castle that appears and then crumbles away quickly. 
I guess it must not have a very good foundation. Well, it's sand. That seems an astute observation. Oh, well, I found it. It was that one. Okay. I forgot that you needed to do a um, one of the flowers, or, you know, a little dune bud there to make it appear. Yes, yes. We're all very impressed by your thievery, your larceny, your petty theft of my merriment jet. All right, well, I don't like the fact that all of the floor is gone already. That's my least favorite thing that happens when I enter a room. But the Shine Sprite's right over there, so this should be no problem at all. Indeed, we should be able to just walk right in there with no troubles at all. Oh man, we might actually just be able to walk up here with no troubles at all. Well, that was easy. <laughs> it was basically just sitting right there for us. I, I, t I take it the Red Coins mission will be probably a little more challenging with all the sand falling everywhere and stuff. And luckily, we get to do that right now! Oh dear. That's unpleasant. I didn't mean to skip that. Well, I'm sure that that's a very interesting thing, but right now I have beach going uh, things to do. What are you panicked about? Horrible! Horrible! Princess Peach has been kidnapped! Well, that is just... By who? Hmm. By whom? I could do Mirror Madness Tilt Slam Bam, but I have a I have another matter to attend to before that, you'll find. Yes, I, me, Mario, I have my important Mario business to attend to, so I am afraid I can't coalesce with you peasants and your, uh, petty problems about princesses and the monarchy. It just doesn't interest me at all. I have beach things to do. Yes. Mm, beach things. This is my new Mario impression. <laughs> I haven't got the beach things to do. Sorry. I'll get to that later. But right now, I'm playing with sandcastles. <laughs> You've reached a Mario. <laughs> but I'm afraid I can't come to the phone right now. I'm building a sandcastle. <laughs> that sounds like something. Uh, that sounds appropriate. Okie dokie. Red coins. Why couldn't they be purple? I guess they are purple in uh, in uh, Galaxy, though. My goodness. Always with the red coins. Who puts them here? It wasn't me. I wonder if it was Luigi. Luigi. Okay, I take it back. This is actually probably not going to be too hard with these. They give us plenty of time for this, it seems. Oh, look at those ethereal trains just uh, running around in the background. Hang on, I have to fix my earbuds. I've got time to fix my earbuds. No, there's... It's really, I mean, this mission is, is just kind of a... It's a freebie. It's another freebie. There's no... There's no... You don't need to rush. You just go with the flow. You know what I'm saying? Where the hell is the last one? Oh, it's on the other side there. Well, that's great, because, I mean, what you have to understand about Isle Delfino is it's a vacation. It's about relaxing. And most importantly, it's about knowing your limits. So if you don't want to have to do something, then you just take it at your own pace. And you don't get the blue one like I was about to go do like a fool there. You dive into this one. Da doy. Man, it's already been ten minutes, and I've only gotten two? That's not a very good track record. I guess I spent a lot of that time uh, milling about in that boss fight like a fool, trying to get it with my eyes closed. I did get the first phase with my eyes closed, which is as good as getting one of the weaker ones with my eyes closed, which is what I was trying to do initially, so I feel like I can let that, that stupid challenge lie and just never try to do that again. I don't know why I think I can do that every time without knowing where I'm looking, and I already am so bad with the whether things are inverted up or down. And that's not neither here nor there. Mirror Madness Tilt Slam Bam, and there's a caterpillar on top of the... Of the whatever that is supposed to be. What is that even? Some kind of weird giant thing. <laughs> alert! Alert! Just look at the top of the tower! I know, there's like a big old green miggler on there. I mean, it's just sleeping. It's not really doing anything important. It's probably fine, right? Those things, are, though, are a little more concerning. I feel like if they weren't on those things, they would be killing people. Some weird thing has curled up on the tower to take a nap. This could endanger the legendary sandbird egg. Oh, could it? I didn't realize that was really correlated. I guess um, that must be some kind of incubator fort or something. Oh, sorry, there was a person over there that I... I could probably talk to you folks. Hey, Eddie, those things up on the mirrors. I wonder if you could shake them off by rocking the mirrors. I mean, that seems like a safe bet. Oh, where are you going? The hill. If we don't do something quick, the sandbird won't hatch. Well, I guess... I guess I'll take care of it. Don't worry, don't worry. So I wonder if this Wiggler is uh, in any way affiliated with Bowser and his schemes. I mean, we can only assume it's behind all of this. Oh, that's a nice noise to be happening. Me, 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 me. Listen to you. I would be uh, indebted to you if you could stop that awful sound. All right, all of you. I'm afraid you're gonna have to... Oh, wait, I don't have to get them all at once, really, do I? I could just get them one at a time, which is, I guess, the smart way to... Ah, it's off balance, but I'm getting killed by the other ones. Hey, yeah! 
There we are. Yeah, one at a time is the way to go, I think. He says doing two at a time. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. No, we can't. Ow. Oh, that one's already off balance. Ah, dang it, I didn't get it fast enough. Yes, I did. I win. Ha <laughs> ha! These things are just unruly. Although I don't really see, I guess... I don't really see what this has to, what these mirrors affecting that thing has to do with incubating the sandbird egg, but... I guess they somehow solar powered and it needs a lot of more sun. It needs like more sun being directed at it in order to properly incubate. Where did the music go? I don't think that's supposed to happen. <laughs> but that's cool. I bet you the music will come back when we fight one of these things again. There we are. All right. Uh, well, that wasn't much of a fight. <laughs> Once again, I feel a bit bad for some of the bosses in this game. Well, I guess this, suppose this isn't really what you call a boss. Not even really a mini boss. They're just kind of things standing around. There we go. Excellent. Only one area now remains. Well, don't get too excited, Flood, because you're doing most of the heavy lifting here. Nah, get some health back. Everyone knows Mario loves his money so much. It gives him a life. Do you want to kill? Oh, oh, you think you're going to Oh, but you can't because you... I've been accosted by the the world's most talented plumber. Please stop doing the things you're doing. They do just make weird noises. They're like weird sort of deranged kazoos. <laughs> Bomp. Oh, it wasn't hard enough. I need a bit of a harder angle on that. Hey yeah. Oh really? Listen, you you're gonna get off balance and you're gonna like it. Hey yeah. There we go. All of that just to get their suction cup feet off the mirrors. Seems like if they're- oh, that thing's head just came off. feel like that might have been my fault. What's done is done. <laughs> it's all in the past now. We can forgive and forget, I'm sure. I'm sure that won't come back to haunt me at all. The murder of that poor innocent thing that just was chilling there. Muff! My legs. Now my shoes are filled with sand. Consarn it. Whee! Ah! I missed. That would have been so much cooler if I got it. Hehehe! <laughs> <laughs> Well, I gotta say, the beach has its perks. Mostly, um, the, the, uh, the, the, all the goods that are lying around. Just for no reason on the beach. That's, that's my favorite thing about the beach. Beachcombing, I guess that's a thing. Although I was meaning this would be, uh, a, a jest. Whew! Here we go! What mission could possibly be next? Wiggle our hoy, full steam ahead! I wonder why. Oh, it's gonna be a tense one, I fear. Yep, this thing's pissed, and it got a he its head back too, which is gonna make it more challenging to fight, I deem. Well, that's- I mean, that's- DIE! Scary- Oh god, it kicked me! Ah, I thought I was in the, in the clear there, so I was about to say something witty. Alright, um, sorry to bother you. What do you make of all this? Oh, protect the dune, bud! You'll see! Alright. What, this one? Well, you did a great job of protecting it, but now I have to use it, sorry. All right. Well, uh, I don't think it liked that. Oh my goodness, it almost got back up onto me. Yep, it's pissed. Time to go. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, I almost didn't go very well. Okay. Executing <laughs> tactical escape maneuvers. Time to leave this island and never come back. It's not gonna come over here through like the water, is it? I mean, it'll, it'll go through the water, but not like over the dock, I think. All right, it's coming over to that one, so I can, I'm gonna camp over here to this one. Come back and fight me if you dare. Oh, hi guys, what's going on? No, 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 calm down there, Mr. Caterpillar. We can talk this over. Nice and slow. Yeah. My thoughts exactly. Yeah, we'll be crushed. Well, I mean, you could always leave, but I mean, I don't have that option because I'm under, like, house arrest, but for an island. Wah! That hurt. I got launched myself into its face, but at least I got it in the end. Oh man, it just slid through a tree. That's gotta hurt. A spiky tree, too. Is that enough for you? Or are you are you even more pissed? I think it's not <laughs> ready to talk about this just yet. The tea the tea having phase of this boss fight is not just it's not happening just yet. Is it coming about to kill me? Oh yes it is. Ah! I didn't get it though, did I? Shoot. Well it's a good thing it only does one damage, like most of the things in this game. I didn't time that very well. Let me try that again. Alright, come on you big ugly brute. Hey ya! I backflipped into it again. What is it with me and just jumping into this thing? Okay, I, I hope I can get there in time uh, that it's sunk all the way in the water. Ugh, it dissolves into sand. 
along with the music. Well, it feels like there should have been a more peaceful resolution to that. <laughs> I feel like we could have talked it over and I could have explained that removing its head was never part of the plan. You know, some people just don't goddamn listen. What is it now? The sandbird is born! Oh, well, we managed to protect it. Well, that was fast. You'd think if it was so close to hatching, then it wouldn't matter if they uh, closed the incubator. Well, the egg is open. Does that mean the bird is somewhere up in the sky? Well, it sure looks like it broke out, doesn't it? Howdy! Is the sandbird all good? Hey, guess what? The sandbird, it, it finally hatched! Don't bother looking for it, though. It flew off right away. Well, at least it's safe and free now, among the clouds, among the... I bet it's right up there in that... No, not that... that... Not that one. That one there, right on the edge. I bet it's just... chilling up there. Although, wait, why is... It's not a cloud bird, it's a sandbird. Although, it's a bird. I guess that's the sky. That's the whole thematic. Hi, am I cool enough for shades yet? Yeah! You're styling now. Come back and talk to me when you don't need them anymore. Oh, I'm always gonna need them, even if it takes the brightness and makes it kind of dark and hard to see. Ah, yeah. Now I'm ready to do a sandbird mission. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this mission is meant to, is thought of in the community as being kind of like a bitch of a mission. But I don't remember it being that bad when I was a kid, so... Let's see if I was disillusioning myself the whole time, or if this is really not gonna be that bad. I do remember, however, that there are blue coins in the middle of this mission and they're a bitch to get. Oh my god, speaking of, there are two blue birds just chilling up here. Cause it's not, it's not Mario if we're not killing some old animals for, we're hunting down some animals for, for weird money. Well, uh, they're all gone. I've scared them all away. Oh hey, there's a blue coin also on top of that post. I guess I was going to call it a telephone wire, but that's not really what it is. Whoa. Okay, one, two, and three. I think that'll be good enough to get us up to this one or not. Ah, ah. Oh man, I missed it. Ah. Yeah, I guess I can't really grab that. That's fine, because there are still these other two blue coins, uh, blue coin birds I've yet to take down. Oh my gosh, what? That, that gull just flew through the ground! What the heck? Are you the legendary sand bird? <laughs> Come on, it's gotta be enough now! Ah! Heck. Sorry, I hit some pedestrian, I think. I heard someone cry out in anguish. There we go, one of two. I used to think they had little Mario hats on with their little red tops of their heads, but, uh... Now I've, I've become privy to the fact that they're just kind of got like, they've got like red slicked back rock star hair. Actually, just before I head on to the, into this sandbird business, I believe there are some blue coins hanging around here that I might be able to get, even with my equipment as it is now. In fact, I think there's one just in this little alcove here. Yes! Right I am! Ow! I hit my face on the thing. Oh, there's one. And there's that one on top of that uh, little weird cabana thing, that, like that down there. But, uh, I don't know that I'll be able to get it without the rocket nozzle, but it couldn't hurt to try. Yep! Yeah. Well, I can't even get up to this other, uh, rope without the rocket nozzle. Oh, wait, never mind. I can use this, uh, this rope up here. I do wonder what these wires are. I mean, I guess they're supposed to be, like, telephone wires, but why would you need such a thing for this place here? All right. Ah. That's got me up to this higher wire. And from here, what do you bet I can just... Fudge my way onto that uh, blue coin there without using the rocket nozzle. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I can, but oh, uh, well, I'm pretty sure the player can, but I do not know that I can. All right, let's face that way, anyways. Two, three. Oh, that's well, not what I wanted, but we're doing this now. Ah, ah crap. Oh, hey. There's a, a turbo nozzle there. Ah. Oh man, I missed that. Ah, whatever. I'm just gonna go to the beach and get some of my water back. All right, now what's the best way to get back up there? What's the fastest way? Oh, I guess just like this. Hover my way up the mountainside. Ouch. I still love how he just tells the wall to watch it. Like he slams into a wall. Just watch it. Look where you're going. My goodness. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to, uh, I wanted to climb up on that. Uh, okay, that's what I tried to do before. I'm, I'm hitting the stick too fast. Okay, so just gotta like one, two, Three, and then we can do this. The only problem is I, I have to like take time to like turn in the middle of that. Oh, I didn't depth perceive very well there. Once again, I'm wasting a lot of time on something that really isn't worth it, but because <laughs> I could just do this later when I get the rocket nozzle, but dang it, I want to do it this way. In fact, it goes beyond a want. I need to do it this, na this way, otherwise I'll never be able to face myself in the mirror again. Okay. Oh, I probably should have done that at a, more like the apex of my jump. Whoa, ah, I caught it though. All right, we're doing this again and less stupidly, and then we're gonna go to investigate this sandbird what's this? One, two, three. And at the apex, well, that wasn't quite the apex, but. Huh. Oh man, I still didn't do, I should have dived instantly. Blech. 
Well, you know me. Once I've set my mind to doing one of these stupid things, I gotta see it through, unfortunately. I promise this won't be another Goopy Inferno. But it, um, it might be close. <laughs> this time. This time, I will make zero mistakes whatsoever, and this will be utterly perfect. Oh, I shouldn't have done it that early. I made mistakes! But fortunately, crashing to the ground face first eliminates all fall damage, just like in real life. Incidentally, I had the same trick work in Grand Theft Auto V once, but I think that was probably not intentional. <laughs> Gosh darn it! I keep doing the thing where I turn before and it kills my jump momentum. Okay, I think that's where I wanted to- Ah, I didn't turn- Okay, wait, hang on, I'm going back. And now we do it. Ah, uh, I still have that turning time. I should be facing this way, actually. That way I, I don't have to do that much of the turning. I'll face the other way. Because it's kind of, sort of not in this direction. There we go. That's much better. I don't want to face the wrong way because then it's like, you, you have to take the time in the air to turn with the hover nozzle. This is the closest I can get to that thing. Ah, crap. At least I caught myself. Three! I didn't get as much of that as I wanted. Okay, I'm mashing. Dive! Ah, god, stupid. If only I'd been facing better. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. In a minute, I'll do it. At least I look cool with my shades. I did the thing again. Woo oh, there actually is a blue coin up there that I didn't realize, but I won't be able, I don't, I'm not sure if I'll be able to get that one without the rocket nozzle. In any case, I don't feel totally compelled to try because since I'm wasting so much time on this one. Mm. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, I did, I did the thing again. No, I fell off the, somehow I fell off that. Goodness, you'd think I'd be a little more, a little more in tune with my own abilities. A little less struggling with such, some, such a simple task as jumping from one wire to the next. All right, I got a lot of height with that. Mm. Why did you fall off of that? I this must have hit B by an idiot. By an idiot, by accident. By accident because I'm an idiot is what I meant to say. That's, I hit B there again. Case in point, that must have been what I did. Ah, it's not the angle I wanted on that, but should be able to make it. Nor not. <laughs> now I can't even get back to that rope. I don't know what it is about this game in particular, and sometimes Zelda games that make me like, I need to do it this way <laughs> once I've picked a stupid way to do something. I guess it's just with any game I love a lot, I, 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 I find myself doing that. Okay, no, I guess maybe diving is not a good thing to do. I thought it would work, because I, th I thought it worked the one time, but maybe if you're going too fast with a the dive, then you can't catch it. Okay, I just flipped onto the same rope from that same rope. This time I've got the height, and now all I need to do is get the distance. Ah, I did the dive again out of habit. I gotta say, it is the most satisfying in the world to just up a cliff in this game. There we go. You can dive to do it. I just don't know. What I'm, I don't know what I was doing wrong before. Okay. Is it more like this direction or this direction? Which? What's the angle that's better for this? I guess I'll, I'll try it with this one because I've been doing it the other way the whole time. No, that's not got it. That's not it. I have to turn this way. It's got to be. Well, actually, you know what? Maybe I should go down the rope a bit so that I, I don't have to worry about turning because it's if at a certain point the angle will be not harsh enough to where I can turn more easily. Ah, uh, not like that. I hit the- okay, so if you hit the bottom of it like that, then it, you just fall no matter what. And it even cancelled my hover nozzle. And just before I got to try out my new angle strategy too. I've spent so much time on this that I just shouldn't be, but now I'm so close. Did I just wall jump into a spin jump? I didn't know you could do that. I mean, I know you could do one once you're in the air, but it looked like I, I did a full wall spin jump, which is very cool, and I did not know I could do it. I looked up- I was like, I wonder why everything's dark all of a sudden. It feels darker, and it's because I got the shades on. Here we go! There we go. I screwed it up again. Okay, never mind. Uh, just sometimes diving is just not good. Don't dive onto the ropes. Since I have to dive to make it. There we go. Okay. There's something about the the, the speed at which you hit it, I think, is, is the problem there. One, two, three. And now I'm turning. And now I do this. Okay, this has got to work. Ah, I held back again. Uh, God, okay. I gotta just... I got. It's always farther away than I think it is. So I just gotta not hold back at all and just go as far as I can. And if I overshoot it, then I'll know that I have to balance it. Oh no, I did the wrong way. Whoops. <laughs> Damn it. Oh my god, I was going to fix my earbud and I screwed it up. I can imagine I get all through all this and then I have this much trouble on the sandbird as well. This is going from the, the easiest episode ever to the most troubling one. Yes! Ah, <laughs> It feels so good when you get it to, when you get it right. There we are, and we want the angle to be something like this. Whoa, I think we had it like this before. 
One, two, three. No, I okay. One, two, three. Okay, go as far as I possibly can. Don't underestimate. Yeah! Thank goodness. It really didn't look like I, I should have to hold the stick in all the way. Like, I felt like I should be able to... I, like, I thought I had to pull back to reach that thing. My death perception just sucks, I guess. All right, well, now that that true ordeal is over, that true test of my courage, patience, and really my... I guess my... my intelligence to see whether I would do it or not is over, let's do this instead. Wow, that's a lot of coins just chilling around there. Wah! Hello, bird! Is the bird in the egg still? No, I guess not. But the egg may teleport us to the bird. The dreaded sand bird mission. I wonder if it'll really be all that difficult. I hope I have the same amount of water. Okay, cool. All right, well, we've already got three red coins, so that's something. Oh, and there's a blue coin right there. Well, that's handy. Oopsies. Oopsie toodles. Oopsie whoopie toodles. Okay, I gotta be careful about getting that one on the tail there. Cause, sorry, let me just fix my earbuds while I'm not playing like a smart person. I have to be careful about getting the one on the tail because, um, oopsies. Uh, cause the one, I, there's not much, there's, it's not really safe on the tail. <laughs> I, I would think. Oh, another blue coin. Boink. I hope those are the only two. I don't know how many there are here. They tend not to be in the secret levels, but this was a special case because they wanted to be just the worst. All right, I'm gonna get that one in a second because it looks like it's getting ready to do some kind of massive turn or something. Okay, here it goes, here it goes. Oh, there's another blue coin on this too? Crap. All right, well, at least this gives me like a platform from which I can sort of distance myself and step back on it. Oops. Oh dear. Oh, don't leave me behind, please. Okay, good. All right, we're all safe, I think. Oh, these blocks are like hollow. Or not exactly hollow, but they kind of like have an indent. It's kind of strange. All right. If you turn it back, then I'll turn back with you. All right, now I feel safe getting on the one tail because it's probably not going to turn again so soon. Ah, the tail's moving a lot though. Whoa. Oh, I almost fell off. Oh boy. Okie doke. Ah, there's another blue coin. There are sure a bunch more than I remembered. Well, that's all seven on the bird, and I think there's one more on a tower somewhere. Oh, it's the tower right there! Oh, well, that's nifty. But then where's the shine sprite? Oh! Well, that was the the, the, the most painless mission in the entire game. <laughs> I'm glad it was as easy as I remembered. <laughs> I thought it was supposed to be hard. I probably missed blue coins or something in there, though. I'm glad we, that was that was easy after the, the the absolute nightmare that was trying to get that stupid blue coin without the rocket nozzle. I spent like 10 minutes on that. <laughs> and then 10 minutes trying to close my eyes and do the thing at the same time. This is the episode where I waste all the time doing stupid stuff. Like, even more than normal. I'm impressed at how much time I've been able to waste. Like, truly impressed. Oh, an LPN Tessimo, you ain't... Ugh, come on. Who do you think I am? You think I'm not good enough for... Oh, wait. What is this? Secret mission for this. Wait a second. Is there another secret level I can't remember in this place? Because what's the what would be the other secret shine sprite? If there's because there won't be another one in the the sandbird because that one's already red coins. Yeah, I am El Pentesimo, and now we shall race to that flag. Well, okay, if you say so. I have a jetpack. I mean, I, I don't know why you keep doing this to yourself. It's a race to the finish flag, and only one can triumph. By the way, the current record is 35 seconds. Are you at the ready? Then get set and go. Okay. Pardon you. I mean, I should have stopped and gotten some shades for this race. But I suppose there's no time now. Because I'm already halfway to the finish line. Come on, Il Piantismo, step up your game. Oh, he doesn't know the secret techniques of- Oh shit. Oh god. I almost screwed it up. <laughs> Whatever. 22 seconds. Well, Il Piantismo, I'm- I'll let you get to the finish line while I uh, go and, you know, just explore around uh, the island a bit. I don't know if- uh, maybe, you know, maybe you'll get to the finish line someday, but for now, I think I'd like some shades, and I'd like to just kind of get acquainted with the area. Thank you very much. It would have been so much funnier if I got them during the race, but that's fine. Also, I think I saw a big old M graffitied here a second ago, so I can take care of that. Oops, I fell. That's okay. El Piantesimo's taking his time, I'm sure. He seems like a very patient person. Was it up here that I saw it? Oh no, but there's a rocket nozzle here. Well, that's handy. I wish I'd see knew about that before. Are there any other coins I could get with- uh, blue coins I could get with this? Actually, yeah, there I know of one. Well, let's start with this. 
Oh, all the, the cataquacks are, are red now. That's funky. Good to see that they've uh, they've all had a, a nice new fashion trend. Hooray! And to here. Oops, I screwed that up. That's fine. Wee hoo! Ah, I can jump backwards up the slope. Excellent. Oh, you know what would be smarter than trying to jump to it from there would be... Let's get some water first, but to going at it from the one below it. There we go. Two, and then come on. Okay, let's just use a rocket nozzle here to get lots of air time to control our descent. There we are. Now there's just the one more rope to get to, and then it just I think we could just jump to this one actually. Oh, so we didn't even need the rocket nozzle anyways. <laughs> I am a, I am the, I am once again. Making a fool of myself. Oh, but there are a whole bunch of coins over there, like... So if I if I did, like, a rocket nozzle jump from here, like... Hang on. I can't do it while facing that way unless I only do one jump, so... Like this! Yeah! Cool! Nice! Well, that's fun. What I just did, that rubbing my face- or rubbing my feet all over that dock. Hey, was there supposed to be, like, a race going on or something? I kind of forget. Ow! That's my body. I usually use that for many things that are not what you just used it for. Oh, hey, there's uh, some kind of dune bud mechanism here. Oh, sweet. More coins. Oh! Well, I found the other secret shine sprite. I forgot it was in there. Cool! I, but I, I remembered there was something in there that when you sprayed the wall, but I thought it was just gonna be a blue coin. I was gonna be like, check out my knowledge about blue coins. Oh, hey, look who finally decided to show up. I guess me. You've been here forever. <laughs> you are pretty good. You have some speed. You have grown ever so slightly in my esteem. Slightly. We will meet again. And goodbye. Helpy and Dismo's got a whole horde of these things, too. It's not very nice that everyone thinks it's my fault. Yahoo! Man, for a racer, he really... I don't know, he kind of took his time there. Just point out facts. I don't even know where to go to do the 100 coin mission for this one. Like, I'm not sure which mission is best for it. But before I do anything else, I should do... Um, I should... Not forget about that secret shine sprite I just found, and I should do that. Do 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 Wow! Where's it going? Come back! Yeah! Wah -ha! Oh yeah! That's a third of the shine sprites, or I guess 47 now if you count the, the ones that we'll be getting from the blue coins. So actually we're more like approaching to half. Still a ways off. Well that's both uh, secret shines from that place, and now we're doing red coins in the royal- in the coral- red 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 reef? <laughs> red coin blah blah reef? Okie dokie! Here we go! Oh and then I- okay, I, I think I know what the other two missions are in fact. There's red coins in the royal in the coral reef, and then there's the Shadow Mario mission, and then there's the accursed mission, which I guess we'll see, you'll have to wait and see what that is. <laughs> but if you're into the the Mario uh, Sunshine fandom, you probably have a pretty good idea. What are all these red ones? I wonder if there's a blue one around that's unique from the other ones, like where there was a, a red one that was unique from the blue ones before. Ow! My that's mine. Ah, gosh. Oh, hey, isn't there a blue coin in this little fruit shack? But like up on the ceiling? Aha! Nice! I'm glad I remember so many of these, because I, I really wasn't expecting to when I started this. I was like, oh man, most I'm like I'm gonna be using a guide for most of these. And the ones I'm 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 either discovering them or remembering where they are, which is pretty cool for the most part. Oh, what did I just do? I just made a tree appear. By watering the ground. Who knew that was how plants worked? I don't know why I want the rocket nozzle, but I want the rocket nozzle. Also, this island out here, well, I mean, I, I was gonna say we have never been here, but that implies I've been here for a long time, which I haven't. I've only just gotten here. And we haven't visited this place yet. Oh, there's a blue coin on the, on the, um, swings. I guess that the reason I wasn't seeing all the ones before is I didn't realize how much of the draw distance affected the, the blue coin, or the coins in general. Speaking of, there's probably coins in the ocean, too. It's, 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 there's one right there. Is that one actually moving with the, the... Oh, it's moving with the fish. So I might need the hover nozzle to, to catch up with this one, actually, if the fish run away from me. Ah, no, come back! I want to be friends! Yes! Oh, hey, and there's another one over there, too. I will say, this open ocean should make me more uncomfortable, but it, it doesn't really, because it's just the, because of the clear water style and all this. Oh, man, there are blue coins everywhere in the water. Oh, don't you try to chase me, you silly bastard, you. I don't have nothing you want! Get away from me! Cease and desist at once. I'll get the blue coin from those fish over there before I 
track down. Actually, I'm, I'm going to be going that way anyways for the coins in the reef, so I may as well deal with this first. I see what's going on here. We get on the swing and, and, pa and swing it back and forth to get that blue coin. I mean, actually, I could probably just do it with the rocket nozzle, couldn't I? Like this. Oh, yeah. Big time. Easy. Easy money, literally. Okay, is there anything else actually on this island? I think these are just... These are probably just co normal coins here for if I'm doing a 100 coin run. Most likely, these are not... Uh, I don't think there are any other blue coins here. Maybe in the ocean? Out over yonder? Oh! There sure is. Or... Yeah, well, there is one anyways. How delightful. And there's Rico Harbor just a, a spitting distance away. And how many blue coins we have here now? 18. Not bad, us. 22 and 21... And nine and five. We're doing okay for blue coins. Covered a fair a fair bit of ground in that regard. Oh hey, the blue blue coin fish have come over here to visit us. I'm gonna dive on them from above. Oh, there is a blue coin in that tree. I can't believe I didn't see that before. Come on, I wanna be your friend. Why don't you wanna be friends with Mario? No, Mario's a perfectly amicable person. Don't run away from Mario. Thank you. <laughs> I thought there's something looked something off out of place about that, um, that tree, but then I was like, no, there's not. They wouldn't put so many clones close together. I was being an idiot. Like usual, I should just investigate you. I should just shut up and look at it. <laughs> shut up and check it out. Woof. Nice landing. Stuck the landing there. Oh, I didn't do the triple jump very well, but that's fine. I got the coin anyways. All right, now we can head to the reef. Woohoo! I'd love to take a, a nice big dive off a tree like that. That'd be so much fun. Are there any blue coins hanging around here? Wait, what was that? I just saw. Was that a blue coin or was that a big old mean fish? Oh, I thought I saw something there. Oh, I guess I, was, I did see the fish. Oh, is that another blue coin swim with a, a, a school of fish there? No, I think these fish are all, are all blue coined out. There's got to be a blue coin in the reefs as well among all the red coins. Uh, it would be nice to have the hover nozzle for this so I could swim a little faster. Alas, I could still do this little swim jig thing to get a little bit of speed. Oh, you guys have one too. You're like some flame angel fish or something. Some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tropical fish. And I will now steal all your money. I mean, you're not using it, right? Seems to be a bit of a running theme, me stealing money from things that are probably not going to use it. But I guess how would I know? What are you? You can't see me. Did you smell me from there? You crazy super fish. Oh, there's another red coin right here. I wonder how many blue coins are actually in these reefs. Because it would be a good place to hide them. But here's one. I've also never seen it. What the heck? I've also never seen a reef that looks like this where it's like rock... In croppings. I guess they probably do exist. It rocks like this where it's like, it looks like it's been carved out, but it's a pretty just cool design of a reef, if you ask me. Ah, and there's some ground here. I wonder if I, this is one of those things where spraying it yields a blue coin. Maybe not. Whoa, the, the water effect goes very weird when you step in and out of the water. And you, you like kind of fall for a bit there. It's almost like you spawn in a different level altogether. One with water and without. That's very strange what's happening here, but whatever. <laughs> it's not like it's, it does anything to hinder the gameplay, I guess. It's just strange. Oh, you know what? I bet there's a blue coin under this dock here. I mean, if I were going to put one somewhere... Oh, I see shadows. There's something down there, anyways. Uh, hmm. Ah! There, so there is. Delightful! They're quite a healthy pace of them here. I guess there's not more, much for, nowhere much for them to hide. Is there one also under this dock here, maybe? I don't see one. Nope. Too bad. What? Ah, I didn't do it. Way I wanted. Hup, yeah, there we go. That's what I was hoping to do. Cover some ground or some water, I guess. All right, where are these last two uh, red coins? I'm assuming somewhere on this side of the reef because I haven't really investigated it as thoroughly. So here's one. Is the other one just around here? On these sort of bally brain coral things? Oh, is that it there actually? Yes, it is. Oh, don't mind if I do. Couldn't have been easier. Yes, yes, I, I can. I, I follow where it is. <laughs> and even if I didn't, it wouldn't be hard to find after. I did a, it was weird, I did a second jump there because of the- because it makes you fall when you get on top of that rock. So he did like the pew jump, like a second of three triple jumps. Three triple jumps? Not what I meant to say. Never mind. <laughs> Abort that train of thought, because I can't articulate it well. Alright, well back in there, no time to waste. I'd say we clear this whole beach this episode. No way, no how, no pausing, no stopping, no hesitation. It's Shadow Mario after him. I have a feeling he won't get far. Oh, look at him just standing on the beach there. What do you make of this? Hey, you! Stop threatening me! What? That wasn't you? Well, it was... It was that me. It's right there in front of you. You can't tell me. You tell me, tell me you can't see that. Ah, you're running away from me, but... Okay, I need my shades for this chase. All right, where do you think you're going? What are you doing spin jumps for? You don't need to gain height. Oh, you're just trying to uh, uh, pull evasive maneuvers, are you? Well, I'll have you know that that don't work in this house. 
Wait, where'd you go? Where do you think you're going? What? Ah! Goodness! Ah! I can't believe I'm missing and I'm so close <laughs> to you. No, don't you dare go up there! There we go. Phew! Dang it! This ain't over! I mean, looks pretty over to me. I don't know about you, but Mario's feeling pretty suave about that emission. I didn't get him as fast as I did in Rico Harbor. <laughs> that was pretty funny, but not too bad, not too bad, time-wise. All things considered, got him pretty quick. And that means only one mission remains in this place. And then the coin, 100 coins mission. But I don't feel like doing that right now. There is but one mission. It is like one of like the big four missions that people dis have distaste for in this game, which are like Pachinko Machine, Sandbird, and... Watermelon Festival. I realize I only listed three. I, I'm pretty sure there's another one that people don't like, but I can't remember it. Okay, let's give it a try. Once again, I don't seem to remember this being too, too trying. Like, it's a bit annoying, but I I don't... I don't know. We'll, we'll see anyways. The thing is, these things are around, and they, uh... Well, you'll see what we're trying to do in a minute. Um, basically, there's a big old... You might have noticed I walked past it before on the docks there. There was a big old capsule which had a shine sprite in it. And, um... You're supposed to get give them watermelons um, for their watermelon festival, but there's only one big watermelon, and it's right here. So you have to roll it all the way down there. Which is very tricky with these uh, cataquacks around, so you have to be careful and bear them in mind. Actually, why would I even bother pushing it this way when I could push it this way instead? And I think it just breaks after a while if you take too much time. To, to roll it there, like it rots away or something. So I maybe have to be, I maybe, I might have already screwed it up actually. <laughs> Alright, I think maybe you can punt it if you like dive into it. Okay, not really. Anyways, uh, let's roll it up here. Oops, oh, I, I myself slipped. Okay, well it's gonna roll down here with me now. But I guess we'll just, that's the thing we're gonna deal with now. Oh, it's gonna run right on this thing. Oh no. Okay, I gotta lure them away from it. Don't you dare go after my watermelon. That's my watermelon. And don't you think you can have it? You either. It's my- Oi, you! That's my watermelon! Don't you touch it! Don't you touch it! Don't you touch it! Ah! They touched it. Alright, well this isn't actually where I was trying to get the watermelon in the end anyways. I was trying to- I was hoping to roll it a little farther along so I could just start down the beach because we're trying to get it all the way down to the dock. So let me do that again and, and not- uh, I won't slip this time because that was what sealed my doom. I mean, I probably could have made it out there with the, even with those cataclysts around, but... Alright, I just gotta roll it along here. What I have to do is I have to roll it along that um, to get to the other thing and then just jump and hover across and push it to safety. Get it down, it goes across, and then just like that. And now it's rolling. Oh, no, oh, I no, it's going to break, isn't it? Ah, no, it's not, but it's going to go much farther than I wanted to do. Don't you dare touch that. That's mine. That's mine. No, don't you dare. That's mine. Eh. Eh. Stay down. <laughs> Stay down, you, you smarmy bastard. And you too. I don't want any trouble from none of you. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to just run you over with the giant watermelon. All right, folks, everyone remain calm. I promise you this watermelon w does, means no harm. Oh, uh, okay. Easy there, tiger. It does kind of have, like, tiger stripes. Okay. The stripes are very pronounced. I usually find they're more blurry on actual watermelons. Okay, easy there. I, I hope I don't run out of time and have it explode on me. But I'm being very careful about this. Okay. I think this is... I'll probably get it there in time. Don't you think? There'll be no trouble at all. Easy there. Alright. Let's give it a bit more speed. There we are! Whoa! Now that's a big old watermelon like I've never seen. I don't even need to get out the caliper for this one. Caliper for this one. You win! Yeah, how are you gonna even get into that saw at once? Oh, never mind. You managed it instantly. Don't think that's how... I don't think saws shrink things into them, but... Cool. Cool stuff. If it means I get a shine sprite, I mean... You won't see me complaining! And all I have to do is jump into a, sa a, sa a saw to get it. Thank you! Now I can make the best watermelon juice for the shine sprites. The yearly tradition is safe thanks to you. You telling me these things can drink? Oh, sorry. No, I'm not telling you that. I have noticed I haven't talked to anyone else in here. Let's have a chat with them. People who eat watermelon with salt sprinkled on it are not allowed in this contest. No, strictly forbidden. Why? I don't know why, that's just a rule we've always had. Well, who would even ever do that? That's like, that sound, that gives me, ugh. Ugh. Watermelon with salt? What, who? Have you looked up into the hills yet? I, I have. Oh, these are cool little coconut drinks. There's a Noki here too. I wanted to get some juice smoothies for the kids, but now, now what? There's tons to go around. The owner of this shop is obsessed with watermelons. 
Well, I mean, it seems to be a running theme, actually. I think a lot of you are a bit too preoccupied with these watermelons. Ah, my feet are fine. Saw or no saw. Yahoo! Well, all things considered, we basically cleared out all the main missions and secret missions of uh, Gelato Beach just now, so that was quite productive of us. Boom. Yeah, now that we're only missing... Oh, that's Rico Harbor. I was like, wait, we're missing one in Gelato Beach? No. Oh, actually, we're missing the 100 coin one for Rico Harbor as well. And we both just have a 19 max score on them. So we should go out and do those later. Ah, uh, but they're such tedious missions to do. I can't believe I forgot to do that for Rico Harbor. Silly me. There's not to be done about it now. I'm gonna leave things off there. Thank you very much for coming around me with me to d and Mari and Mario f to Delfino Plaza. And I hope I will see you again next time in Mario's Sunshine. And I guess we're gonna... Uh, maybe we'll do the, clean up those 100 coin missions or what? I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll go where the wind takes us, as it were. Or maybe we'll go investigate that very strange submersible that is just kind of chilling in our bay. Or not our bay, but, you know, the bay of, you know, it's just chilling around. But until then, Admiral's going to be out of here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I'll see you around. Peace. Uh, boomerang you. Ah, well, that goes very, but... I don't really have a good ranged weapon to hit you with other than the boomerang, but that just stuns you, so I have to wait till you're close. Like this. Hey, yeah! Oh, I knocked you too far away. 